Probably. I tell you what, if it were eighty dollars, how much what is the, the, cu the cover? Uh, it's so worth it. You talking about the curve the foot? cover chain stitch foot? Oh, what's that? It's called the super foot. Cover chain stitch foot. Now we did a. Cover we did the cover foot. foot. We've done the chain. I mean, we've done the curve. We've done a cover stitch and we've done a chain stitch. And are they with the red? But I never used this foot. We just did them with the. It's a little foot. skinnier than the other one. And it does not have the slots for the overlock needles. So it can only be used in the cover stitch position. Okay. Um, I've just done rolled hem on the edge of my fabric because I'm going to make a little ruffle. And uh, set up for a cover stitch wide. And I'm going to change my differential feed up to two. Oh, and as well on the. Uh, this one, the, the door sticks out, comes out from the bottom rather than the top. And if you've ever sewn with the top open, you know it messes with your tension. So this is an improvement too, is now it swings from the bottom. Okay. I've turned my differential feet up to two, which we all know is going to gather the fabric now. But it does such a good job. I'm going to stitch length up. I don't know if I don't know if it's just that it's narrow and it puts more pressure along the um, feed dogs mm -hmm. than the other one. Really good ruffle. Really, really ruffle. Now, I have taken a, I'm going to turn my differential feed back now, and I've cut just a little piece of a bodice, if everybody recognizes that, and then I'm going to put that there, and I have taken a little strip of fabric and folded under on both sides, so that I have a little piece of ribbon, if you, <laughs> and tell them to put it back. I'm just used to it. I, I really do like its convenient location. And it does come with a knee lift, too, So for those that like that. And I'm, it, this little foot has an opening on it, a little split. And so your ribbon will fit right in there. This is the cover Like change. that. We're still in the cover. Mm -hmm, cover chain. So I've got it in there, and we'll put it on the machine. Might need my tweezers. Grab my handy dandy tweezers. If you sew with a serger, you know how invaluable those are. Same foot. Chain cover stitch foot. And now I'm going to put my ruffle. And I'm going to put my bodice on the bottom. My ruffle on top. And we'll lift it up to the, take it to the needles, and then I'm going to attempt to put all three of them at the same time. And since this is in that little groove, I don't really have to worry about it. It's not, it's going to feed right in that little groove. No, it won't gather it again. I did. It won't gather it now. It won't gather it because I've turned my differential feed back down. Okay. Oh, I couldn't wait to get this thing out of the box. It hit the back door and I'm like, stick it, get over it, get over it. Like a kid on Christmas. He said, oh, go ahead. <laughs> and so, now I have it on the front of my bonnet. Isn't that just the neatest foot? Everybody wants one, right? Mm -hmm. I want one. So that foot, that new foot has a thing that you can put ribbon, ribbon or I just took fabric and folded it in, you know, kind of made by a strip really. Yeah. It's only, I think, five, five millimeters wide, the slit for the ribbon, but yeah. So now I could take this back and gather 
my piece, my skirt piece, and add it on. So you can see how easy it would be to do it on the on the serger. What machines does that put fit? This one fits the uh, Evolution, the Evolve, the Ovation, and I believe the, it will fit the cover stitch machine. It may fit the Diana because all of those have the cover stitch function. This is a cover stitch uh, format, so you've got to have that option. And I don't think the Enlightened does. I'm pretty sure the Enlightened does it. So I think that's it. Thank you.